Kesk is sup, it's the Chappers. Welcome to Chappers TV. When it comes time for me to write a melody or a riff or anything on the electric guitar, and sometimes even vocals, to be honest with you, I sit down <clears throat> and I go into kind of a Chappers like trance after enough caffeinated dark black mother has been consumed uh, occasionally after listening to something inspiring and um, or watching a load of stupid stuff on YouTube and what I do is I I jam I go through a warm-up first and then I jam and my mind goes through a series of things that over the years I suppose I've learned to to run through and it's a process that I do pretty much every time I sit down with a guitar and I've never really discussed it before and so I thought what I would do is give you an insight into that so whenever I sit down to write or even play I normally just film it so this is just a camera aimed at the guitar nothing fancy while I am pulling out parts of this to show you um, for educational purposes or just because it might be interesting for some of you. Um, I've annotated um, areas where, where in my mind I know I was thinking about a specific topic or, co or concept. So for example, um, I do a thing that Chris Cornell did for writing lyrics, which is I imagine a scene or a scenery or like a, a landscape and I try and describe it musically. Steve Vai famously did this uh, exercise he would give students, he would say, imagine eating an apple and then describe that in a guitar lick. You know, the crunch of the skin, the juice from the flesh, that kind of thing. And um, I have found that absolutely invaluable in writing. Um, and you can see in this piece of, of guitar playing how I'm trying to describe a scenery. Um, it leads me to choose a mode and a bunch of chords. Um, and then I start to consider tone, and then I focus more on letting go of all the theory and just playing, seeing what comes out from this kind of place I've created, with the ultimate aim of, this is a very serious Chappers TV, the ultimate aim, oh, it's too serious. I know what you need to know. What you need to know is, what is? Chappers Choice! Today's Chappers Choice is the 68 million year old Ankylosaur could be 11 meters in length and up to 7,000 kilograms in weight. He damn well ate a lot of food. As do I. And I know what you want to know is... Oh, has Chappers consumed? Today, I consumed copious amounts of sushi, freshly delivered to my doorstep by a man on a bike. Thank you, man on bike. I really appreciate that. As you can tell, it has a glorious texture and incredible flavor. I'm a big fan of sushi. It's a healthy, delicious treat. It's good for you. Try it. Sushi. Discuss. So yeah, the, the aim of this really is to show you the insight inside my head when I create on a guitar. Um, cue the video. <laughs>
It always helps to begin by choosing an instrument that inspires you, something that you connect with in a way that makes you feel like writing. Do you know what I mean? Some guitars, you pick them up and you just want to shred, you just want to play. Some guitars you pick up and they give you the feeling that you want to create something, and it's always a different instrument for me, um, and it becomes harder when you have a lot of instruments. Uh, and for me today it was the ML1 Pro in Sun. Sometimes it could be my Gretsch hollow body, sometimes it could be my Fender Tele, um, sometimes it could be my Custom 24. It always varies. Today it was the Sun. Well, I tremendously hope that was an incredible amount of use to you in some way or other. Thank you for watching this episode of Chappers TV. Have a wondrous day. Take it easy. I bid you farewell.